Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule. Nos programs offer plusieurs langues. Veuillez visiter suprememastertv.com barre oblique schedule. Nuestros programas ofrecen varios idiomas. Visiten suprememastertv.com barra inclinada schedule. Nuestro programa oferuje wiele języków. Prosimy zobaczyć suprememastertv.com ukośnik schedule. Get healthy, happy, and active while enjoying the benefits of plant-based living with Dr. Angie Sedegi, a certified gastroenterologist. She will be sharing some fantastic whole food vegan recipes with us. Beneficial whole food vegan meals from Dr. Angie Sedegi on Jane Unchained, part one of two, rainbow salad and almond yogurt parfait. Watch on to find out more. Hello, I'm Dancia. Sending much love from the scenic British Virgin Islands. We wish you knew the beauty of our wondrous world and the precious gift of an enlightened living master who is always with us and guides us towards a more peaceful and compassionate life. Welcome to our show. Beneficial Whole Food Vegan Meals from Dr. Angie Sadegi on Jen Unchained, Part 1 of 2, Rainbow Salad and Almond Yogurt Perfect. The channel Jen Unchained promotes a compassionate vegan lifestyle, raising awareness of animal rights, and has attracted more than 1 million followers on Facebook and Twitter. We are so delighted that Jen Unchained provided Supreme Master Television with this informative cooking demonstration from the 21-Day Vegan Kickstart, an incentive program launched by the Physicians Committee for Responsible Medicine, or PCRM, in 2010. The cooking demonstration is conducted by Dr. Angie Sadegi and hosted and filmed by Ms. Lisa Kalan. Dr. Angie Sadegi is a board-certified specialist in gastroenterology and a weight loss expert. She switched to a vegan lifestyle when she had the realization that the so-called food she was consuming had suffered enormously. Embracing this enlightening moment, she started eating a whole food plant-based diet, which soon transformed her health and body, enabling her to compete in fitness competitions for the first time. Her personal journey fueled her desire to help her patients to achieve the same goal. She says, bring healing and improve the quality of life for those individuals looking to stay fit and healthy through the use of nutrition, fitness, and bioidentical hormone therapy. Ms. Lisa Kalan is an instructor from Food for Life, an award-winning PCRM program designed by physicians, nurses, and registered dietitians. The program offers classes that focus on the beneficial life-saving effects of a vegan diet including cancer and diabetes prevention and treatment, weight management, and employee wellness. They also offer kids classes that empower them with knowledge of a plant-based diet. Now, Dr. Sadegi will show us some fun and delicious vegan dishes with an added bonus to keep us healthy. Hello, everyone. I'm your host, Lisa Carlin, and I am here with the amazing Dr. Angie Sedegi. She is a board-certified gastroenterologist. We're going to have a delicious salad. Health is number one on my list. So I don't care if something sounds 
or tastes absolutely delicious, but I'm gonna feel sick afterwards. But I don't really wanna sacrifice on taste either. So I kinda okay. wanna have it all. So this is a salad that contains organic kidney beans, cabbage, corn, butternut squash, tomatoes, um, quinoa, tacopitu, verde de mango. This is just salsa. How much oil is in that dressing? Zero oil. This is um, apple cider vinegar. Let's put it together. Let's do it. I've already put about a cup of cabbage. Here's a cup of red kidney beans. They've got a lot of fiber, but also a lot of protein for those of you who are proteinaholics out there. Um, this is butternut squash. Isn't that beautiful? Red, what does that mean? It's got what? Beta carotene. And converts to vitamin A in your body. Uh, these tomatoes are full of antioxidants. Watch us create the colors of the rainbow here. And when you have a colorful plate, that means you're creating a plate full of different types of macronutrients. In our society, unfortunately, we focus on the wrong thing. We forget, focus mostly on macronutrients and we focus on protein. Macronutrients include um, water, protein, carbohydrates, and fats. Okay. But you know, there's a world of nutrients out there that are not those four named, including vitamins and minerals and antioxidants. So if you want to be a better athlete, what do you need? more antioxidants to Im improve your recovery time so you can train harder and faster, to stay healthy, to fight infections, to fight cancer, right? We all want that. Here's some corn. I'm gonna add the corn here. Look at that, all these colors. They're Isn't that beautiful. beautiful, Lisa? They're beautiful. Here's the I rest of the cabbage. cabbage. Quinoa has a lot of protein and fiber and um, all kinds of nutrients, vitamin B. It has all the essential amino That's acids. That's right, isn't that amazing? Like a lot of people think that they have to eat animal protein to get protein because they think that a lot of plant-based foods don't have all the essential amino acids. And in fact, quinoa and soy are two examples where you get all the essential amino acids. If you're not eating either quinoa or soy, you can put together all different types of plants and it'll all come together. So it really isn't necessary, that's old school. Okay, this is looking really good, Lisa. Looking all right. great. Here's some oregano. A lot of people are looking to decrease their body fat mass, not really body weight. What you need to do is decrease your calories and eat healthy, right? When you add a whole bunch of oil, which is refined food, which is basically has zero nutritional value and it's unhealthy, what you're doing, you're increasing the calories. So you wanna avoid oil. When you eat a high fat diet, what you're gonna get is all these bile acids that are proven to uh, cause um, the destruction of the tight junctions in the gut and cause uh, the so-called leaky gut or gut permeability. This is our dressing here. It's beautiful, it's colorful, it's tasty, it has zero oil. We have one woman, Debbie says, don't we need some oil though to keep our joints mobile? <laughs> <laughs> no, you do not. Not unless you're the tin man. <laughs> um, what makes joints immobile is inflammation created in your body by, um, in, uh, by, by eating bad foods and sometimes genetics. There's a theory that it all starts in the gut. By eating bad foods, you get systemic inflammation that is in your blood circulating all over the place, including your joints. All the white cells are attacking your joints and eat up the cartilage in there, and then you get stiffness and problems. I have had patients who would go plant-based um, and they get rid of the, uh, their, their joint pains and they can walk. I mean, it's incredible. Not only do you not need oil, it's actually bad for you. So you will cause more inflammation. Like whole fats are really good for you. So there's a difference between olives and olive oil, okay? Olive oil is refined and the fiber is stripped away. Whole olives are different. Uh, so those fats are really good for you because in your body they're converted to this essential the omega-3 fatty acids. Omega-3 fatty acids are good for your gut lining as well as for your brain. And so, and you have to have omega-3 fatty acids. And what's the best source? Um, I would say all the fats are good. For me, avocados are big in my diet. Um, nuts and seeds, sunflower seeds, uh, something yeah. I consume regularly. And uh, is, is flax seeds. Yeah, flax seeds, chia seeds, yeah. hemp seeds. And if someone's really concerned, they can take an omega-3 supplement. Smart viewers. 
we will take a moment to watch the latest video on Jen on Chain. Please stay tuned to Supreme Master Television. We will be right back. Welcome back to our show, Beneficial Whole Food Vegan Meals from Dr. Anje Sadegi on Jen on Chain, part one of two, Rainbow Salad and Almond Yogurt Parfait. Let's continue to watch Dr. Sadegi make almond yogurt parfait and explain why we should not consume animal milk. Here's an awesome snack. Almond milk yogurt, okay? And it's plain. So why don't you want to eat regular milk, you guys? This is very important. Dairy, which comes from cows, and this could be goat milk, camel milk, I don't know, dog milk, whatever. It came from, <laughs> it's not meant for human consumption, right? So cow's milk, which is the most popular milk drank in this country, is full of lactose, the sugar lactose, which is very poor, poorly digested in our intestines. It causes constipation, uncomfortable gas, abdominal distension and bloating, and uh, diarrhea, and all kinds of problems. A lot of people who come to me for IBS, I realize they're eating dairy, and when they, they stop eating the dairy, they're, lo and behold, their IBS goes away, so they never had IBS. And they think you're an incredible doctor. You're that's so smart, you know? <laughs> I just know a lot of nutrition, that's all. Oh, besides the lactose sugar, there are two proteins um, in dairy, which include whey and casein, both causing thousands and thousands of people in the United States suffer from um, dairy allergy. I was one of them, by the way. I suffered from debilitating, very itchy, ugly, pustular eczema all over my body and I itched all night and all day, every day. And none of my dermatologist friends or um, doctors ever said, hey, you may want to try stopping dairy, which is probably one of the largest causes of allergens in this country. I saw a million dollar vegan campaign that's on your Instagram, Angie dot, A-N-G-I-E dot Sadegi, S-A-D-E-G-H-I. Yeah. You said it should be illegal. And I stand by that, Lisa. First of all, at least put a warning sign and tell us that it's not health food, it's bad food. Sell it as junk food. How many thousands of people are dying and getting sick from eating dairy and consuming dairy, not knowing what they're doing to themselves? And the environmental problems that it's causing, and most of all, the absolute inhumane problem that's associated with consuming dairy. You put all these three things together, and I would bet you 100% if you present the data to any reasonable person, they would say that it should be illegal. And um, I honestly don't think anyone, anywhere, any restaurant, any grocery store should actually serve dairy. And I, I foresee a future in 10 to 20 years where dairy is not going to be served anywhere, and it would only be smuggled in the country. It okay. would be illegal. All right, so tell me, how did you do this little parfait? You just put the almond um, milk in there and you put blueberries and you can use fr frozen blueberries. They don't go bad and it's cheaper to buy frozen berries. Do you lose yes. anything freezing them? I don't think you lose anything at all. I don't know exactly with fruits, but with, with vegetables, it's actually pretty beneficial for people who have gas and bloating if you eat frozen vegetables. The ice breaks the cellulose, so it's better tolerated. With fruits, you don't have to worry about that, and of course, you don't lose any of the nutrients, and it's not perishable, so it's a win-win it's in my opinion. Ingredients. For all ingredients, please use organic versions if available. For the vegan rainbow salad, the ingredients are two cups of cabbage, one cup of pre-cooked red kidney beans, two cups of yellow squash, two small tomatoes, two cups of cooked quinoa, one cup of corn kernels, oregano, one and a half cups of salsa verde, four teaspoons of apple cider vinegar. For the vegan almond yogurt parfait, the ingredients are vegan almond yogurt, fruits. For more information about Jen Unchained, please visit jenonchain.com for more information about 21 day vegan kickstart kit please visit kickstart.pcrm.org for more information about dr angie sadegi please search her name on instagram noble viewers we hope our show has been insightful so you can choose your vegan food wisely Please join us for part two of our show next Sunday when Dr. Angie Sadegi will make vegan pita pizza topped with hummus and overnight oatmeal and share more of her expertise and knowledge on the benefits of whole foods. We wish you 
and your loved ones happiness and good health. For free international vegan recipes and for language availability, please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash VEG and suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule.